What's up, YouTube? Leo Shang here, host of the Extreme Fully Fishing channel. Today is September 15, 2017, my outing number 115 of this year. As you guys can see, a little change of scenery, huh? Today we are here at LBI. I'm here with my friend, David, Simplex Fishing. And check it out what we're gonna do today, huh? Aha, this is not the bait that we're using for today, by the way, right? This is just <laughs> the rest of some crabs that people were using here. But precisely what we're going to do is dog fishing, okay? I mean, you guys know me. I'm going to be doing my multi-species angling, but we did get a lot of green crabs from the tackle shop just now. <laughs> Dave, you want to tell people what the tackle shop owner kind of told us there? I pinched me out. <laughs> Kids, don't don't attempt to do that outdoors, okay? <laughs> it hurts so bad. <laughs> oh, this was so feisty. Green crabs can be quite dangerous, oh, all right? God. So yeah, check this out. We got the little green crabs here, little fellas. Yeah, don't don't do some don't do some coyote Peterson stuff, okay? Yeah, I, I, look at that, dude. That's pretty bad, yeah, man. He, he injured me, man. Hope he hopefully he uses he catches a tog. Yeah, but anyways, that's gonna be our bait for today. We're going to be doing some dog fishing and as you guys know Dog fishing is all about putting your stuff in the holes, right? So we got some holes right in front of us right here Dave says there's a 10 feet drop off right in front of us This is the game plan for right now and when we went to the taco shop funny story, right? Dog, li <laughs> dog limit is 15 inches one per person at this time of the year we went to the bait shop, got four dozens of green crabs. The dude probably thought, man, this Asian is going to keep all the fish, right? Yeah. Which, is thing, which is something that we don't do, as you guys know. But anyways, right, as we're leaving the taco shop, the dude just tells us, oh, have a great weekend. And don't forget, don't forget to pick up some kids on the street, give them some rods so you can take more fish home. Dude, that is pure savage right there, okay? But... Anyways, I gotta get my stuff set up. If you guys want to learn how to do some dog fishing, there's a video on the channel for it already. Make sure you go there and check it out. In this video, I'm just gonna quickly go over the setup that we're going to use for today, and we are going to get the fishing started. So stay tuned, because today, it should be a good day. Whoa, dude, oh, that's, that's legit, that's a fish. Oh no, is that a tog? Ouch, dude. Oh, it's small tog. Oh, look at that. Uh, first fish of the day. It hard, too. Dude, it came, out, it came up almost instantaneously, huh? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Nice run, right? Yeah, but a uh, little bit too small, that yeah. one, though. So small. So Beautiful small. little fellas. We're talking about the Tautaga Onitis here, guys. Yeah, slippery. This is pretty much the biggest ras of the Northeast, you know? And of course, they are very yummy fish, which is precisely why a lot of people around this area take tog home to eat. Oh. Boom! One happy tog. Got one? Nice one? Ooh. Yeah, it, it is looking nice. Oh yeah, not bad. Dude, Dave is his lane then over here. That's a better one for sure. Yeah, oh, that's nice. Wow, look at that, dude. Fat. But 15 inches though? I don't know. I don't know about that. So how how big you think this one is? 12. Yeah, I would say definitely not 15. Yeah, 12, 12. Uh, yeah, that one goes back. Oh my God. Oh! No. Oh, he's good. He's good though. He's good. He's back. He's back. Whoa! Oh, good one. How big you think? No. Will we hit 15? Oh, dude, that's fat. Oh, dude, that's nice, man. But I don't think it's gonna hit 15 though. Yeah, about 12 and a half, 13 inches. Oh, this was on. Hell yeah, after so many misses, man. How's it feeling? Feeling good, but it's 
probably same size or smaller. Oh, uh, yeah. Not 15. Not bad, not bad though, man. So far, it's like 4 0 right here, man. Gotta catch up on my game. Yeah, man. I don't know. Is that spot over there? <laughs> That's Talk good. Oh, I'm snagged. Oh, I, I, I'm on, I'm on. Finally. Oh, no, look at that. Oh, no, look at that. The sea bass. First species for me, not quite a tail tog. Sea bass. Beautiful little black sea bass, though. Alrighty, guys, final view of our first species of the day. Not quite the tail tog that we're looking for, huh? But a little black sea bass. If I remember well, its scientific name is Centropristis striata. Very common in the New Jersey area. Have caught him, this fish, all around. Go back where you belong, fish! Let me go to the right side. I got it, but mine's small. Whatever it is, is small. Yeah, it's a small one. It's him. Yeah. Small sea bass again. Sea bass, what are you doing here? Yeah. Go back where you belong, sea bass. Yeah, but I think it's another sea bass. I don't think I am in the tau tog zone, man. I don't know. I've been casting out there and getting instant hits. Sea bass zone. Yeah, I'm in the sea bass zone, dude. Because I downgraded my hook, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. The sea bass are attacking it pretty good. Look at that. I'm not a black sea bass. Dave, Dave has got like six tau togs so far. I landed one tau tog that I didn't really film because, you know, my GoPro wasn't turned on. I've been landing some sea bass. Actually, it has been pretty hot. You know, we lost a bunch of rigs, but fishing wise, it's been pretty okay. I think before my, because I'm using one ounce, before my stuff can get all the way down, the sea bass just gets it, you know? I may have to put a bigger piece of, uh, of crab here. All right, it's on. Whatever it is, it's on. This doesn't feel like sea bass. This feels like tog. Let's go. Yeah, this feels like tog, dude. I got that line there. Yeah, I got it, I got it. It's, it's coming up, it's coming up. It's coming up. Oh no, come up here. What is that? Oh, this is a nice tog, dude. It's a nicer tog. Oh yeah, oh yeah, this is a nicer tog, dude. Oh, hell yeah. Would this hit 15 inches, though? I don't know, questionable. He's super close. He's super close, we're gonna measure it, we're gonna measure it. Oh my God, no! <laughs> it's 14 and a half. <laughs> it's a freaking 14 and a half. <laughs> <laughs> oh, it's okay, it's okay, it's okay. Oh, so oh nice my god, oh. dude. He looks so yummy and so good. But it's a 14 and a half, guys. Oh, no. We gotta take... Oh, gee, 14 and a half. Chunky one. I go back and grow half an inch, all right? All right, people, we've been catching some fish over here. Uh, Dave has been slaying the tail tug, but nothing over 15 inches so far. I came really close to a 14 and a half, and that was like the biggest one so far. So let me quickly show you guys here what we're using for today, okay? So we bought these green crabs here from the tackle shop. They're live, okay? They're very mean, so you gotta be very careful when handling them. See, we just got the green crabs like this, and then we cut the legs off. So let me just uh, quickly do some animal cruelty here. No, I'm just kidding, okay, guys? No animal cruelty on the channel, okay? This is bait, bait, right? So there you go, we got a little crab. Cut it in half, boom. See that, just bang, destroy it. And then I just get half of the crab, right? On a dropper loop rig, just the hook and sinker. And there you go, boom. See, just hook it up like that. Very simple. When the Tau Tau gets it, right, you just get the hookup. <laughs> Look at that. 
little sea bass right there. Now this is what we've been doing for today. Hopefully we're going to catch some keepers here real soon. Yeah, I think he, I think he just chewed the whole thing and didn't get to the hook. Oh, oh no, no, another bite. Oh, it's on, it's on, it's on, it's on, it's on. Come up here, come up here. Oh yeah, dude, it's a nice one, it's a nicer one. Definitely a nicer one. Oh yeah, oh yeah. Oh yeah. Whole crab, dude. Whole crab. Whole crab. Oh, not, not the sizes that we're looking for. Not 15, but... Oh, dude, double up on the tog, man. Oh, you gotta be kidding me. Whoa, whoa what is that? Oh, that's a tog, yeah. Whoa. So yeah, guys, we gotta, we gotta double up on the tog right here, but all shorts today so far. Almost identical size. Too. Almost identical size, yeah. Look at that, huh? Dave's right over there. Crab's working good today. All right, time to release this guy. This one here ate the whole crab. <laughs> okay, time for our Tao Tog to go back where it belongs here. It's a nice, nice fish right there, fellas. Whoosh. Oh, there's a bunch of line coming up. Baby fish, too. What Whoa, that? how did you hook this? Oh, no, it looks terrible. Oh, no. oh my god, bergal, dude, though. that's it's a bergal. It's a bergal. It's a bergal. Dude, you butchered. Let me take a look at that. You butchered that bergal, man. No, man that How the heck did you? Whoa, oh, dude, it's stripes are hanging out. Okay, dude. Death, man. <laughs> hey, hey, it's, it's not, it's not a tog, at least. Dude, the samurai, man. That's that's the what the hook set does to the creature. Oh god, you think he'll survive? He nah, he was just gonna die for oh, sure, 100%, man. Blue fish. <laughs> oh, 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 come up here, come up here, come up here. Come on. Dude. Oh, dude. Come up here. Not bad, not bad, dude. Not bad, not bad. Oh, dude, come on, B15. So oh no, oh no, it's stuck on some junk here. All right, there we go. Flipping time. Oh yeah. That one oh dude, this one looks solid. I don't know. I don't know, it looks, <laughs> chunky. <laughs> it looks chunky, but I don't know if it is 15. Let's measure it. Oh man. All right, let's see. Oh, 14! Where? <laughs> oh my god, uh, no! Yeah, pinch the tail, make sure. Dude, now it's 14, oh, yeah. man. Yeah, it's 14, so there you go, guys. Huh? Another nice style tog here. 14, 14 incher. Ah, close, but no cigar. All right, guys, final view of our tow tog here. Bye bye, tow tog. Grow one more inch, okay? One more inch. Ah, uh, sea bass, or a little tog, sea bass probably, yeah, little sea bass, what do you think you're doing, huh, sea bass, stealing all my bait, huh, you think that's cool, go tell your family, never come back here, okay, not until you hit like 18 inches or something. Oh, you gotta be kidding me. A bergal, dude. Jeez Louise, look what showed up, huh, guys? Little bergal. Tautogolabrus at Spercius. Definitely not what we're looking for. Okay, people, time to unhook our bergal. Very, very slimy little fellas here. Ouch. Oh, there we go. Little bergal, ready to go. Boom. Oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah. Get out of there. 
Come on, boy. Get out of there. Oh, yes, yeah, son. Tell you, it's the whole crab, dude. It's the whole crab, man. Oh, yeah, look at that. Not bad, huh? But I don't think it's gonna hit 15, man. I don't know. All right, that flip. That flip! Not bad, not bad. This one's close. All right, we had two today so far, a 14 and a half. Please be 15. Goodness. Yeah. Oh, yeah. yeah. Well, let's see, let's see, wait. Let's put the fish on top. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Oh, yeah, oh, yeah. He's good. He's good, he's good. Finally, all righty. All right, people, quick update. Been fishing out here for a few hours with my friend David. Finally, after two failed attempts, we landed, you know, a keeper. I'm pretty happy about that, you know, it was quite a struggle. You guys didn't really see in this video, but I lost more than eight rigs in this spot right here, you know. There's a lot of sinkers and hooks down there. So anyways, uh, when it comes to blackfish, right, tail tog, it's only one a day at 15 inches, so I'm pretty much done with that. What we're gonna do, we're gonna switch techniques right now. I gotta put some clams on instead of green crabs, and we gotta do some good old multi-species fishing, okay? So let's see what we're going to catch besides black sea bass. Oh, that's nice. That's nicer. I don't know. But uh, maybe a towel tog? Oh yeah. On the clam. Little wow, dude, when they are young, they are beautiful, man. Look at, dude, wow. Look at those collars, man. I gotta tell you, when they're young, whoo, this is top class right here. Beautiful fish. When they get old, they get dark and ugly. All right, go back, Tau Tog. Alrighty, people, final update. As you guys can see, we kind of moved the spots. You know, we've been trying to catch different types of fish. Dave and I right here, we've been struggling today. Check this out, guys. I was just casting, of course, a pink mag daughter right here. <laughs> and no bites, no love whatsoever. So, I mean, at least we got some tau tog today, right? And one bergal and some black sea bass. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video, you know? It was very basic, simple fishing, right? Just baiting the hook with green crabs and throwing out there. We got snagged a lot, but I tell you what, catching that 15 incher, that keeper, the sense of accomplishment was really good. So, all right guys, I hope you enjoyed this video. Uh, maybe we're gonna do some more fishing today after here. But if we catch anything, I gotta post in another video. If not, this is my adventure for today here at LBI. Tie lines, folks. I will see you guys next time. Oh, oh, check that out on the rattle trap. Oh, son. Dude, you catch those little snappers on everything. Look at that, folks. On the little rattle trap. <laughs> Isn't that crazy, man? Yeah, look, dude, in the mouth. Look at that. Inhale the little rattle trap. Gee, man, who do, who would have thought? Huh? Bluefish hit everything, man. <laughs> this is pretty nuts.